channel and here is the question we have. So we have to find out the root of this question using bisection method. Okay. So here is the normal step. F of x is equal to x log x minus cos x. And here is we have correct up to three decimal places. So that means n is equal to three. And to find the error, we have to formula like 10 power of minus n by two. And that is we obtain like this also. Now after this, find the root interval using tabulation methods. So for this, we use the calculator and always remember one step, always make your calculator in radian, okay? That is, press shift mode and here is 4, that is radian, press 4, okay? Now, after this, uh, press uh, 7, that is table, okay? Now, here is f of x, so f of x is, here we have x log x minus cos x, so write this, alpha x, and here is log, that is ln, and x, we have written a log ln x, okay? Because, always remember that if, here in the question, we have log x only, okay? So then, in calculator, write ln, okay? And if in the question, we have log base of 10x, then always write in the calculator log, okay? Always remember this step. Now, we have cos x, that is minus cos alpha in x, okay? Now, it start means from where we have to start. So, it start from 0 and it up to 5 and at how many step we obtain the solution, that is 1, okay? So, here you can see, it does 0. It, if x is equal to 0, then we obtain f of x is error, that is infinite, okay? And if 1, then here we have 0 0.5403. So, right up to 4 point, after point term, okay? So, here we have written up to 3, 4 number, okay? And again, here the 2, here if x is equal to 2, we obtain 1.8024. So, here you can see, so here you can see here, here is no, uh, here is infinity, and here is negative sign, and here is positive sign. So, the po here is sign change, okay? So, the sign change is 2. So, you stop at this, up to this, okay? Now, after this, here is sign of fx exchange. So, you have at this one word. So, this is the step, normal step, and here we have a is equal to 1, and b is equal to 2. So, if we put a is equal to 1, that is, if we put 1 in this term, we obtain this term, okay? Negative term. And if we put b is equal to 2 in this f of x, then we obtain this solution number of step that means up to what number of step we obtain the solution so here is number of step this is the formula okay so here is the formula so here is 10.96 that is up to 11 step we have to perform the solution okay now here is the main part okay so now applying formula of bisection method so see, this is the formula of bisection method so x not is equal to a plus b by 2 then 1 plus 2 by 2 so we obtain 1.5 and if we put f of x not that is f of 1.5 then we obtain this solution which is not equal to 0 that is this is positive term okay now we have to find the, finding the successive exponential roots by using table for bisection method. Now, we have to use calculator, okay? We can use calculator to find out all this solution, okay? Step by step. Now, uh, now watch carefully for this step. Now, okay? Now, for this step, so here you can see here is number of iteration, a with negative f of x. Here you can see if we put a is equal to 1, we obtain negative term, okay, in the f of x. So here you can see we obtain negative f of x. And here if we put b is equal to 2, we obtain positive f of x. And here is x naught is equal to a plus b by 2, that is, this is the formula by section method. That is, at 0, it is x naught, and here is 1, that is x1, okay, so, and sign of f of x. So this is the sign of f of x. Now, after this, now, here is, as it is, now, after this, so we have to find out the solution of this, so, for this, uh, we have the calculator in a radian form, okay? Now, press on. Now, clear all of calculator. Now, for this, we have to make this calculator in the radian form, okay? So, press shift and more, then press on 4. And now, and to find out the solution, uh, and to find out the point, we have the term that is, press A, then here is A term, okay? So, A, and as it is B, then X, X, is equal to then press a plus b by sorry two okay so again y press y is equal to y is equal to and here we have to in the after y right the question as it is okay so x x, sorry, x, log ln x, x minus cos x, okay, so after this, so here is the term we have written, so, so to find out the term here we have the formula that is, uh, so formula here is a, b, x is equal to a plus b by 2, y is equal to um, f of x, that is, x, log x minus cos x so you can sort this uh, part okay so you can sort this part so here you can see this okay so this is a and this is b okay and this is x okay this is x okay this is x okay so this is x and this is y okay this is y right now after writing all the term in the calculator then press cals okay c a l c cals now give the value okay as it is now the value of a is one the value of b is two and the value of uh, this you know, y is that is here we have x naught that is uh, 
सो ये वी ऑप्टेन द वैल्यू ऑफ इफ वी गिव द वैल्यू ऑफ वन एंड टू वी ऑप्टेन द वैल्यू ऑफ एफ ऑफ एक्स नॉट एट इज वाई इज टू जेड पॉइंट फाइव थ्री सेवन फोर फाइव थ्री सेवन फोर सिक्स ओके ना वी ऑप्टेन एज गल वन बी इज टू एंड एक्स नॉट इज इक्वल टू वन पॉइंट फाइव दट इज एक्स नॉट इज टू वन पॉइंट फाइव एंड यू इज वी हैव वाई इज टू पॉजिटिव टर्म ओके सो इफ यू ऑप्टेन द साइन ऑफ एफ ऑफ एक्स इज पॉजिटिव देन चेंज द दिस दिस पुट दिस वैल्यू इन दिस पॉजिटिव टर्म ओके सो ये वी हैव पुट दिस वैल्यू इन दिस पॉजिटिव टर्म ना ओके ना आफ्टर दिस प्रेस इज टू ना द वैल्यू ऑफ ए इज वन वैल्यू ऑफ बी इज वन पॉइंट फाइव वन पॉइंट फाइव एंड लिव दिस वाई वैल्यू एज इट इज ओके सो इट विल अपडेट इट्स ओके नो सो ए इज गल वन बी इज गल टू थ्री वन पॉइंट फाइव एंड यर इज एक्स इज गल टू वन पॉइंट टू फाइव दट इज एक्स वन इज गल टू वन पॉइंट टू फाइव एंड यर वी ऑप्टेन द वैल्यू ऑफ वाई इज गल टू इन नेगेटिव टर्म ओके सो दिस इज राइट नेगेटिव ओके सो यर वी ऑप्टेन द नेगेटिव टर्म सो पुट दिस वैल्यू इन दिस नेगेटिव टर्म दट इज ए विथ नेगेटिव एफ ऑफ एक्स ओके सो इफ यू पुट यर सो इफ यू ऑप्टेन यर नेगेटिव टर्म देन पुट दिस बाई सेक्शन वैल्यू यर एट दिस नेगेटिव टर्म ओके कंटिन्यू नेगेटिव टर्म ओके सो टू आर्स नेक्स्ट टर्म ना ओके A is one point two five, and B is one point five. As it is, and Y as it is, live as it is. So here we obtain one point three seven five. Now one point three seven five, and here we obtain Y is positive. Okay, so we obtain the value of Y is positive. So here is positive. So if we obtain the positive, that means this term will be the in this term. Okay, so in the next forward step. So here is one point three seven five. So that means one point two five, and one point three seven five obtain the value of B, and Y as it is. And here is we have obtained one point three one two five one point three one two five, and here we can obtain the value of y is obtained as positive. So positive means put this value in this next step. Okay, and this value is negative term value as it is. Okay, now this after this a is one point two five and b is one point three one two five, and y is it is and here is mid term that is one point two eight one two five and here we obtain y value positive. Now continue this step up to eleven step. Okay, so up to eleven step we obtain this solution like this. Now. Here the eleven step, so you have find out this solution b minus a. That is this minus this. Okay, so we obtain the this term which is less than a. That is zero point zero zero point five. Now and the root of function lies at one point two. That is this is the root of function. Okay, is point up to three decimal places. So we have a plus is equal to three point five into n to the power minus four. So that is we obtain this solution. So in this way we can find out the solution using calculator. Okay, 